Hey, good morning, Facebook friends and family. Day 15 of the 22 a day for 22 days challenge to raise awareness for the programs and practices that are available to help prevent veteran and military member suicide. Uh, today's Memorial Day, kind of a, a somber but special day for most of us that have worn the uniform and also to the friends and family members that have lost uh, men and women that were serving. Uh, you know, growing up, Memorial Day, I, it didn't really strike me as just a military holiday. It seemed like we always got together. We put flowers on Grandma and Grandpa's grave, uh, just remembered people that we had lost, not just people that had served in the military. And it wasn't until not only I served in the military, but I had also lost friends that were wearing the uniform that lost their lives in a combat or a duty related uh, incident so once you go through that it's sometimes it's easy to get angry when we see people uh, misusing Veterans Day you know saying thank you for your service is for Veterans Day uh, saying thank you to people wearing the uniform is Armed Forces Day. And really, I think we should salute our men and women that wear the uniform and also our, our doctors, first responders, nurses. Uh, these guys, man, I tell you, they, they're always thinking of others first. But Memorial Day is not that day. However, uh, the 22... Most often, they're out of the service when they decide to hurt themselves. But I honestly feel that inside, most of them feel that they died overseas or when a buddy died and it just it impacted them. Survivor's guilt, um, just things like that can eat you up inside so guys I'm also going to recognize the 22 on Memorial Day whether they took their lives when they got back home or uh, if they still had the uniform on and and something happened that just caused them to make that irreversible decision um, today's challenge I'm actually going to dedicate today's video to my buddy Mike six Christine his grandfather Wendell he was very close to him uh, he was one of Mike's or six's inspirations to join the military and uh, it gives me so many different things to talk about because Mike's uh, nickname there six is uh, something that uh, military guys use all the time they say I've got your six which means I've got your backside if you think about a clock 12 o'clock position six o'clock position so the six is your backside and when you say I've got your six it means I've got your backside I've got you covered I'm not going to let anything happen to you so my buddy six is called six there's another interesting story to that but we'll save that for another time but six has probably lost more friends to suicide than anyone that I know. It tears me apart, man. I know um, he goes. Uh, it has to. It has to be eating him up. The things that or the friends that he's lost. Uh, never an easy thing, Mike. You're always strong. Um, I appreciate your your strength and your perseverance. Um, and I know it's tough, man. When I see you post those uh, tributes to friends that you've lost, it really tears me up. But um, you know, you just recently lost your grandfather. I know that uh, that's probably got you feeling kind of depressed. I lost my mother last year. Uh, anytime you lose somebody that's close to you, it's difficult. But one of my wellness practices that I absolutely love is music. And guys, if you've ever, if you're friends with Six, if you've seen any of his stuff, uh, he's a, a music maker and a DJ, spins some great tunes. Uh, and I think that, Mike, I know that you've got some physical limitations. Uh, I know you've had some injuries and stuff. But I think it would be pretty cool if you could post a video every day, 22 days, one video each day that talks about a different song or track that moves you and, you know, maybe how it 
it can help other veterans to heal. Just an idea. If you'd rather do push-ups or sit-ups or a physical challenge, you got it, buddy. But, um, man, music is always something that I think uh, touches a lot of our lives. And I really believe that uh, music and battle are, they kind of evolve together. It, no other profession do you hear sung about quite as often as you hear the uh, soldiers, Marines sung about. Uh, and with every generation, each war brings new songs about that generation and the things that they're going through. And across all genres, whether it's rap, country, rock, metal, you hear each of those uh, reflect the struggles of war. So I think music is a great way to heal. So today, my wellness practice is music. My challengee is Mike Six Christine. And uh, Mike, I've got your six. Hopefully, I, I know you got my six too. So here it goes, brother. 22 for your grandfather, Wendell. All right, guys, that's it. Uh, big, big thank you to my wife. Yesterday's recovery helped me tremendously. As always, join me tomorrow. See you. I call out next.